Postpartum hemorrhage is a potentially life-threatening bleeding that can occur after delivery. External aortic compression can be performed to achieve temporary bleeding control prior to or at the same time as causal treatment. The aorta is located in the midline, in some patients slightly to the left of the midline. The aortic bifurcation is situated below the level of the umbilicus. Blood supply to the uterus is primarily from vessels below the bifurcation. Reducing the flow in these vessels will reduce the bleeding regardless of the cause. With a closed fist, the aorta is compressed against the spinal column at the level of the umbilicus. As the pressure above the compressed area increases, distinct pulsation will be felt on the side of the hand that is towards the patient's head. During pregnancy, the abdominal wall muscles stretch and divide in the midline. This reduces abdominal wall resistance, making it easier to perform external aortic compression. When external aortic compression is performed correctly, an ultrasound probe placed over the femoral artery will verify that the blood flow has ceased. The following three signs confirm that compression is being performed correctly. Reduced or ceased pulse in the femoral artery, reduced visible bleeding, stabilization of the patient, including reduced heart rate and increased blood pressure. If the desired effect is not achieved, it is important to increase the pressure or reposition the hand, as the uneven surface of the spine combined with an uneven surface of the fist may impede the compression. Evaluation of effect is important to ensure sufficient compression. As external aortic compression can cause discomfort and pain to the patient, it is important to keep her informed about why it is necessary.